What's going on, y'all? So, about to play my first round of matches for the new series, or I mean season. And, as you might imagine, uh, like I've been feeling recently, I don't know what I want to use. I mean, because I've used all these teams before, I'm relatively comfortable using any of them, right? And so, I kind of would like to use the Giratina team, but... You know, we've got fun stuff. If anything, I don't want to use this team right here because this is what I started last month with. So I'm going to, you know, I'm just going to roll the dice again. That's what I'm going to do. So we're rolling the dice. And we get a four. So cool. One, two, three, four. We're starting with Eternatus. Okay. That means we get to test if Wakanberry from Wakan is good. The Wakanberry from Wakan. Wakanda. You guys know. All right, here we go. Kuyan. Okay, yeah, for a second I looked at this and I was like, do they have two legendaries? Um, they do, they do. So let's see here. Um, I like Entei. I mean, I think Entei needs to be a little bit careful, but in general I like it. Um... Rillaboom could actually be pretty good, except for the fact that they probably want to, um... They probably want to... Bring an Intimidator, right? So, I mean, like... That's something to, to kind of think about. Um... Just because we're, you know, being crazy, let's, let's maybe try it. Let's bring Eternatus in the back. And... Um... Entei? I mean, like, do I really need Tailwind here? I don't know what they're gonna start. Um... So what I'm going to do... I don't know what they're going to do. That's how I feel. And then, yeah, we get the grassy seed. So good. Um, I'd say they might like switch out. What I'm gonna do is drum solo and speed swap. Okay, good play. Annoying play. Annoying play because I should have made the opposite targeting decision, right? And they're probably like, what is he doing? What is he doing? Yeah, so, I mean, I'm playing this way too risky, right? Like, that's that's kind of the problem. I, I could have avoided all of this. 
uh, by, I mean, targeting Feeny, I guess. But they should protect Feeny. Nope. Not very effective. They dazzled the lane. Um... So this could obviously get pretty bad. I'm going to max Quake here, and I'm actually going to um, Pollen Puff to try to deal with them. And hopefully it does enough. I mean, it very well might not. <sighs> Please. I'm counting on you, Pollen Puff. I mean, I feel like they probably have a Soul Vest, but like... <sighs> Clutch. <laughs> I said, I don't care about being slow. <laughs> There's the Calyrex, okay. So let's think. We definitely want to max darkness here and probably just like protect for now. Good play. So this will definitely be interesting. It's not over at all. Um, I actually kind of want to target down this slot, but okay. Well, we got the special defense lowering, so I'm gonna say yeah. Let's target down this slot. Um. And my best play would technically, I think, be to switch into, like, Entei right now. But Entei might just get sacked is the unfortunate thing. That's fine. 
also, I mean, we do need to be careful here. But... I want a Dynamax Cannon. And I want to... I guess just Sacred Fire just in case. Eternatus cannot hit. Um, what's his name right now? Eternatus can only hit. Um, Calyrex. So we do know, like, I don't know, the Calyrex should pr protect or something, like, I would imagine, but I guess maybe not, but, um, I highly doubt Entei lives this. Yeah. If it did, that would have been pretty nice. But, uh, okay, I don't think we played this perfectly at all. Because we are officially dealing with, uh, Speed ties, which is never fun, you know. <laughs> they go first. Yep, GG's. Oh god, we didn't play good. I played bad. I could have had that Feeny gone long ago. I could have. Yeah, yeah. GG's, I guess. <laughs> Not a great start, but. You can see what I was going for. I do actually think we probably could have O-Code Feeny though, if we had made the right targeting decision. understand why I was threatened by Groudon, but if I was them, I wouldn't have wanted my Groudon to take the damage either, so. They didn't protect that turn, or did they? I don't remember. Um, okay, so we've definitely got to be careful here. Um... I kind of want to start Wim's Eternatus, honestly, and <sighs> Wim's Eternatus. I mean, you want to bring Rillaboom, but it's kind of rough. Wim's Eternatus with Entei and Rillaboom. I mean. Speed swap Entei looks pretty good here, but 
we already know that they need two airstream boosts to outspeed Entei anyways. So in this situation, we want to, um, if they send out Groudon Charizard, we want to target Groudon. So we'll see what they do. We obviously want to hope that we don't make the wrong decision. So we Dynamax Cannon and we fake tears even though it could be a bad play. I think the way I feel about this team is that it seems like you just really need to like make the right play. And if you don't, you probably lose. Um, and this is an example of that. So, like, if they max guard, that's awesome. If they don't, we're definitely kind of screwed. Um, well, maybe. I don't, I don't know if I would say screwed, but like, I am going to be very happy to get rid of this thing. But the problem is they still have their max, right? And then they get to do that, which is not good for me. But it could have been worse, let's be honest. Rude boy, rude boy base. Um, let's just tailwind. Well, they're not. Uh, they're not protecting. So, <laughs> goodbye. Yeah. 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 I might think about doing the same in your position, my guy. <laughs> As they say, uh, ye. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah. Could have won that first one. <laughs> but no. We made bad plays. Hey, look, it's my guy. Hey, look, it's my God. Um, um, I actually really like Entei here. I think Entei looks great. I'm going to start Wim's Entei with Calyrex and Eternatus. With Calyrex and Eternatus. Yeah, yeah, those are Pokemon. I mean, you know, you gotta give it that.
There it is. There it is. Beautiful. Just beautiful. So what I want to do here is I actually want to start getting set up for the late game. And I want to Sacred Fire. And I want to Fake Tears. do that too. That feels like a slightly unfortunate turn of events for them. Rock fall. Okay. I know it could be a you know, policy Giratina, so I'm gonna respect it. <laughs> Alright, let's please get this KO. Thousand boys. And at this point, we just tailwind and we max flare the Zacian. Because that's what it is, right? It's a Zacian. Let's flare the Zacian. They should know though. They should know what's gonna happen. They protect. That's exactly what you should do. Technically, Wims isn't really putting on pressure, so if you're them, I think that makes sense. Um, I feel like just in case I need it in the end game, I should fake tier Zacian. Like, because, you know, Sacred Fire can miss, let's be honest. But 
we hit, so good. Very cool, very cool. A man after my own heart, you know, as they say. <laughs> so he just went max HP, max special attack, Draco Meteor Protect, Shadow Wall, Ancient Power. I get that. Um, I think just Earth Power is a little nicer. I also thought that Energy Ball was really nice, so. Oh god, it can protect. Focus Sash, yeah. Yeah. It, it, yeah, okay, you see? You see? This is what I've been saying. I said it. I said that Imprison is good on Giratina teams. And so I might actually have to think about going back to it. Um, Cobo Berry does have Charm, so I think they could have gone for that if, instead of setting up the light screen, but, you know, I, I get it. Cool. Cool. Like I said, a man after my own heart. <laughs> I could stop there, but, you know, I'm not, I'm not quite done. Even if we lose the next one, whatever. Okay, so this definitely has to be a whims game. But the question is, what else? We could start Blastoise since it has the Wakan Berry from Wakan. Um... Is that really, is that too risky though, is my question. Cause like, just cause my myth has the Wakan Berry doesn't mean he's safe. Um, it, this lead is also very passive against, uh, pretty ugh against the Kyogre lead, I guess, so. Um, I mean, I want to do that with, like, Rillaboom and Eternatus in the back, or Calyrex. It probably has to be Calyrex, but... This is a situation where you could actually lead, um, just Wim's Eternatus. But you do need to be careful. like if they start certain things they start winning strategy lackey right so wins eternatus was actually my best lead um i think the question that i have for myself is just this i mean Wakan Berry from Wakan. Hope it goes well. 
<laughs> Eternatus would have been better here, if we're being honest. Um, but it's hopefully fine. Because at this point, I mean, what should they have in the back? Like, Calyrex and Kyogre. Oh, God. That's going to do a lot. Okay, well, it could have done more. What are you feeding that? For real? Why did that- what? Is it not very- it's- I don't know, man. Sometimes I just don't know. Okay, well, at least we made the right targeting decision. Okay, I would say this went from bad to okay. I think... We just... Did they just cancel? Okay, for a second I thought they did. Let's knock off and let's, um, Hailstorm. Okay, okay. For a second I thought it was special, but... Why? No! Why? This is gonna come down to a speed tie. And it's, and I mean, if they just protect Calyrex, they can just win anyways, so. Um. I think. They definitely have specs, I'll tell you that. Give it to me. Give it to me. Okay. We 
we can absolutely still lose this. We can 1 million percent still lose this. I think in this case, I really want to just see what they're going to do and also get residual um, healing, so... We both have Tailwind. I hated that game. <laughs> that was no fun. Oh god. <laughs> the single target plus two Astral Barrage had to do it to him. Um, well, I mean, good, you know? We got a three out of four. I'll take it, you know? I'm not complaining. I think that was a good set, you know? We, we didn't play the first one well, we still tried something fun, we demonstrated that it could be crazy, and, you know, a, we were a few decisions away from a, a set of four that we won all of them, but, of course, if I won the first one, the other games could have gone differently, and, you know, that was good content, so, all over, GG's to those people, already enjoying the start of this month, and, uh, you know, you'll just have to see what happens, so, uh, Thank you all for tuning in and peace out. Did I show the rental code? I don't know if I did, so let me do that. It's in the, the you know the last video, but I'll do it. Yeah, so you got the team. Uh that last opponent definitely they lost because they were expecting me to max guard. But if I had max guard, I would have max guard. So, you know, you really got to think about things like that. Um, <laughs> um, so GG's, yeah, great set of matches. That They must have had like a Soul Fest Reggie Lecky or something because that was just ridiculous. But, um, yep, thanks for tuning in and peace out, y'all.